Well, hello, everyone, and welcome to the fourth installment? Yeah, fourth. We're on four of these. Woo! It's playing alone together. I'm Sean. That's Scott. Hi. And we're continuing our eight-part interconnected Dream Eaters campaign today with the search for Kadath. Now, mm -hmm. um, if we if we recall from last time, our Jack deck, you you kind of because you were here for the last time I played Jack, and then I the was, other yep. guests who have been on uh, uh, were were <laughs> were around for my Duke deck. Um, the nicer of the two, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> So we got 10 XP last time, and I think ultimately we made the right call that we just straight up said, throw it into Janae. Mm -hmm. So we yeah. took Janae at taboo cost, uh, so so 5 XP for two copies, so that was, that was all of that. So that's upgrades. So Now we hard mulligan for Janae, right? That's... I mean... <laughs> Almost, right? I really hope I see her early. That is that is what I want. Mm -hmm. So let me make sure I got set up all taken care of with my handy dandy Arkham cards assistant. We, we love cards. Arkham cards here Best at Ghostbusters. If you haven't, if yep. you haven't, you should. Not a sponsor, just a good product. Well, I mean, As we the, sponsor uh, them, so yeah. <laughs> Their money has changed hands. We support. Yes. There's um, a magic streamer who uses these like um, token things, and every time he's like, oh, use this, and he looks at the camera, and he's like, not a sponsor, just a good product. <laughs> just... <laughs> yeah, it, it bears uh, clarifying. Okay, so Black Cat was not at our side. Luke is not in the group, so we skipped to intro four, um, which means we then go to intro five because we parlayed with the Zoogs. Mm -hmm. I believe, yes. So intro five is when we round up to, oh yeah, the temple, the temple, and we either leave empty-handed or force our way in. Do you remember what that does? We were talking before, we... we were talking before we started streaming. The theme of this campaign is that Sean has no plan. He just has a lot of experience with the campaign. <laughs> so we're, we're doing this on the fly. Um, if we force our way in, isn't that the way we get drunk with the priest? I believe so. We do also piss off cats. Mm. Do we want to piss off the cats? I can't remember that. <laughs> but we do get drunk with the with the moon priest, which I feel like is what Jack would do. So, yeah, that is. I know that that is like the the number one thing we want to do. Mm -hmm. All right, cool. So we force our way into the temple, which means we get around to intro nine. Uh, we get one evidence of Kadath, and we parlayed with the Zoogs. Blah, 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 blah. Um, I'll make us an evidence counter. Yeah, yeah. So then we get another evidence of Kadath. And then two XP, which I'm not going to bother with right now. We'll just save that for next time. Yeah, I don't think you're allowed to bother with it. I think that's accurate, because we have now started right. this scenario. So we already have two evidence, is that correct? Yep. Sweet. Um, I think that makes the skulls minus two, though. Oh, no. Signs of the Gods is the... Right. Correct, so correct. And then signs, Sign of the Gods eventually translate into... Yeah, at um, the end of the scenario. Yeah, into evidence. Okay. And also experience, I believe. That would make sense. Okay, so we start out with Ulthar, Sky River, Dilath, Lean. We start in Ulthar, set a bunch of stuff out of sight, out of play, which I'm sure the mod has grace graciously done for us. Mm -hmm. We get the pack of Vuniths. They swarm, right? So They do. Okay, so after I'm mulligan, I gotta give it a swarm. I get Virgil Gray. Well, here's a question. Mm -hmm. If they're swarming, wouldn't they do it before you even draw your hand? I think the rules are that you set up your investigator and then you set up the scenario. Hmm. I think. Oh, whatever. I heard someone that random I trust deck is random. say that at some point, so now I take it as truth. Hmm. Um, okay, so let's see. Oh, my. Well... I'm 
Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and perception. Show your hand. I don't know that I'm looking for him in an opening hand. Yeah. I feel like I hold on to these two. Uh, yeah. Wow. Lone Wolf off the hop is uh, beauty. All right. Let's see how we do. Okay. All right. Okay. We got what we need to get rolling anyway. Yeah. This is, uh, this is not bad. Like, you get Lone Wolf out, mm -hmm. you pick Thieves Kit, or. Ooh. Your memoir that's that's a choice <laughs> yeah well i mean it works either way because like if i get the draw down then i just use jack to get resources and we get the resources down yeah. so i think i think i think memoir, here, memoir I might be better because it's a higher number right mm. it's a higher because i'd be investigating at five with it but uh grim memoir gives you plus two so you'd be a six Accurate. although you might want to save the grim memoir for higher shroud look you know if you put down your if you put down your thieves kit, mm -hmm. then you get more resources, mm -hmm. which means you can play your grim memoir sooner. True. True. And then you get both out, and then you titrate, which based on the clue value or the shroud and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We got there. I don't think I didn't there. appreciate your use of the word titrate. Mm -hmm. I, I love that word. <laughs> All right. So I have to say, I have I have liquid courage in my opening hand here. Quick aside. Um, recently when Nick and I got together, we were able to play some standalone Arkham and I just, mm -hmm. I, I brought a couple of the decks I had and then I, I threw together, a um, a Dexter Drake deck that was mm -hmm. like 20 assets. And yeah, two of yep. those assets were Liquid Courage because I figured like, ah, I'll throw mm -hmm. it down, get a couple oh, yeah. of heals, chuck it out, do the Dexter thing. Liquid Courage did so much work in that scenario because like people were taking horror left, right, and center. Mm -hmm. Insane. I like every time I every time I've seen that card since that game, I'm like, yeah, yeah, you did it, buddy. Good <laughs> job. Yeah. All right. So, so uh, swarming, boom. Thank you. Whatever that is. Okay, so... You are at Ulthar, sir. We start at Ulthar, which is Veiled, although I've played the scenario before, so I know better than to <laughs> flip it. It's the newbie trap. <laughs> it surely is. It's, uh, I mean, it's literally, like, the, the flip side of Curiosity. Um, mm. So, you know, Curiosity... In, in, in Soviet Ulthar, Curiosity kills you. Mm. Or makes the cats kill you. Anyway. Okay. So, one, throw down Thieves Kit. Well, here, I'll read the agendas or the oh, relevant yes, stuff real you, quick. Um, so, if you're at a port location, you can resign. Um, yep. You got seven Doom Counter. And the act, uh, at the end of the round, investigators at a port location may spend the requisite number of clues, which is two, as a group to advance. The thing I love about playing this scenario solo is that you never have to like wait for anyone else to truck in behind you. Mm -hmm. Because yep. so often, like three out of the four people will have really good pace and be get through completely fine and be like ready to roll at the end of turn one, and then that one mm -hmm. person who couldn't handle the Vuniths is like lagging behind. I think that was yeah. So Iron Man, if I recall correctly. Yeah, and uh, a little counter here is the signs of the gods. All right, um, action two, then I'll throw it on Lone Wolf. Mm -hmm. And action three, we'll investigate. Five up. Did Seems I do... okay. Did I do the bag correctly? I don't think I've adjusted the bag yet, because this campaign gets, like, fiddly. Mm. Um, I see two skulls, no elder thing. Cultist and Tablet. Yeah, so there should be three skull. Oh, here. Let me just let me just look. Oh, here you go. Um, only two minus ones. Yeah, see, there's a weird bag. Where's the little? Uh, uh -huh. Am I missing a little button to set the bag for standalone? Is that here somewhere still? Uh, no. Interesting. All right, that's fine. We'll do we'll do it manually. It's cool. Mr. Lazy to you. Totally that one person lagging behind. Hey, it is Sunday morning. That Sunday morning is a lagging behind morning. 
Yeah, those of us who play a lot of uh, Mystic tend to be that player. It's a it's a slow start for for most of us. Mm -hmm. okay, You're not so used to this uh, blazing speed of Monterey Jack. Right. Unbridled efficiency. Oh man, riveting twitching! I know, getting my bag in order here. One cultist, three skulls. Um, and then two tablets. Mm. Yeah. There we go. Beauty. Oh, also, you have the uh, the lead investigator token. I'll just put it by your mat for you. Oh, thank you. J just in case you forget who's lead. Yeah, I often do. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, five up on this investigate test. Yes. Reveal another. Ooh, reveal another. Minus three. Cool. Succeed. I succeed, and I get a resource. I'll bring your clue over. I'm basically your butler. Tap 90 Jumalauta. Welcome. Glad you could catch us. Yeah. Good morning hours hopefully make it a little easier for some. Okay. Yeah. Especially Europeans. Yes. I believe. Our Euro friends. Okay. Yeah. Um. So, uh, keep... Oh, wait. These guys don't do anything, do they? Nope, no, they do they, not. They hunt. Just... Okay, cool. Lovely. We Another are... thieves kit. Holy moly. Yeah, I know. We are one of seven doom. All right. Night Riders. Hmm. Don't need a snap. There we go. Hmm. Hmm, indeed. All right, well, your yeah, turn begins. This is a really bad first draw without. I'm not, like, super set up for it. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. boy. Okay. Well, the good thing is you have Virgil, who can tank a lot of horror. True. All right, well, I am the only investigator here, so let's start there. Mm-hmm. Oh, man, like, I gotta... I'm I'm at even to fight and I'm at even to evade, so I gotta try to evade it, right? And just like pray I pull a zero. Yeah, I mean I would even risk drawing a card. Oh, you think so? Because you can tank it on Virgil. Yeah, and hopefully get an icon either way. Yeah. Okay. It's an attack of opportunity. No, it's just one. Swarm. Oh, never mind. My math is wrong. Don't do that. Oh, don't do that? Okay. Yeah. I always tough. forget about Swarm. It's really tough. God, this is going to slow me up so hard. Of course. I'm like, yeah, yes. let's go fast. Let's go fast. And then the game's like, whip, whip. Yep. All right. Well, here we go. Evade. Open for a skull or a zero or a plus one or an elder. Yeah. There you go. That's. All right. I take back all my salt. You know what? Um, that, that's just skill, right? <laughs> Drawing the right token at the right time. Fuck that. I'd, ra I'd rather uh, be lucky than good any day. I'd... Well, okay. you got to be lucky to be good. you got to be good to be lucky. That's so. true. All right. So then second action will move. Mm -hmm. oh, that's when you attempt to leave. Okay. So these guys pop to me. Well, it has no swarm cards attached, so I feel like I just I want to evade these guys, right? Yeah. Okay. Easy peasy. Last action evade. Five up. Oh. Uh, I would draw a card off that. Oh, show. Mm-hmm. And then they're evaded. I'm just going to leave them there because they're coming right back. Yep. Is there a clue here? No, there's no clue here. We just we we nope. move through and get out. Okay, cool. Yep. All right, then. Um, and then I'll go ahead and jack for probably another card, right? Yeah. I think so. Your resources are, I mean, between um, <gasps> Lone Wolf and Thieves Kid. <gasps> oh, my God. Full build. 
Bless you, Sean. Thank you. <clears throat> okay. Yes, that whip came at a clutch time. Jeez. Mm-hmm. Okay, so now keep. All right. Look at yeah. your hand as a rogue. Oh my god. Now we're in business. This is this is a solo yes. rogue hand right now. Yeah. <laughs> okay, two of seven. <sighs> of course. Oh my god. Possibly my least favorite card in this entire scenario. Mm-hmm. Okay, so attach to your current uh. location after you move out of the attached location. Take a horror, place a doom on the current agenda, and discard Song of the Maga Bird. This effect can cause the current agenda to advance, and then I've got to test either willpower or combat for to get rid of it. Yeah. This is Ancient Evils. This is Ancient Evils for me. It is, yeah. Yep. Ancient, ancient Evils, evils plus horror. horror, I guess. Yeah. Which, as you pointed out, Virgil very much can help me tank horror, so there is that. Yeah. And you will be getting uh what's it, the sign of the a sign of the gods? Yeah. In this area, so mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, cool. Um Lone Wolf. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, let's evade the Vooniths. So plan for the turn. Yeah. You're thinking evade, move, investigate, yep. and then nice. Yep, and then do I have a do I have to... Oh, it's an action. There is, no, it's, that's, I don't want to resign. End of the round, you'd spend clues to advance. Yeah, and then we're out of here. Yeah. Yep. So here's... I mean, I'm four up. That's as high as I could hope to be. Yep. Oh, my God. I almost hate to see it there. Yeah. Useless. Okay. Evaded. Then, uh, second action, when I attempt to evade, I'll test agility two. I believe, yeah. I do probably want to, I really want to hit this, so I think. Ooh, um... Slip away or breaking and entering, do you think I should commit? Oh, uh, I feel like breaking and entering, because we got our clues down. Slip away can lock down those really annoying enemies, yeah. and I think in solo... Yeah, that unfortunately. But all right, so four up on the river sky river test. Mm -hmm. Oh my god! <clears throat> right. We have drawn five tokens this game, mm -hmm. and three of them have been elder sign or auto fail. Okay. If you all fail, right. Somehow I failed. Great. Yep. Love that for me. Cancel the effects of the move. There is a creature here. So you add a swarm. Oh, add a swarm. Okay, that's fine. Okay, we'll try again. I mean, this flips back over. Yep. Now you can just move. Oh, if this is because not been flipped over. Yeah, so I don't even have to attempt. Yeah, okay. It just the clue the clue thing slows you down. That's it. Yeah. Okay. Well so. we'll deal with that then. God. Uh God. Maga Bird does trigger, so Doom plus a ping for you, and I'll get rid of it. Thank you kindly. And that's going on, Virgil. You know what? This um I mean it's slowing us down a turn, but yeah, Two I mean, turns. you could use the action on, on turn one, and then the game's like, yeah, oh, all the bad things. Uh, well, hello, Na Nathim. Na Lurk away. Yeah, lurking's cool or chatting too. All right. Um, Yodi. Oh, I jack. Man, so many new names. Yeah, I know. Yeah. It's nice to see some new people in here. Welcome, welcome. Mm -hmm. It's uh, it's been the benefit of of taking a long unintended hiatus from streaming. Uh, there's there's mm -hmm. a lot of people who kind of came and 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 we haven't seen before. Yeah. Okay. So. Done your actions. Okay. So you did Monst call it song of the Ma Maga Bird. So end of my turn. Yep. I probably draw. Yeah, I draw. Yeah. Can nice. we upkeep? Cool. Oh wow! All your clue tech. Yeah, I know. Like I'm, I'm loaded. I'm kitted out for for the rest of the game now. Yeah. 
Okay, so All then right. we go to four of seven doom. Yep. Gross. A zoog bro. If you found there are no such enemies in play, search for a zoog, draw it. Yeah, okay, this is fine. I think I'm fine. I'm just going to take this at two up. Because if I need to go get a zoog, I can evade it. And yeah, yeah. I, I think I have the actions to spare this turn. It shouldn't be a problem. Yep. Completely agree. All right, two up. All right. Ooh, that's a pass. I do love the art. I love all the Zoog art. Zoogs oh, like fit that like very specific butter zone of being really kind of cute, but also super horrifying. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah. Can you see any Zoogs in form? Uh, there is a Zoog somewhere oh, in there. Zoog is back behind me. He's he's front and center. Yeah. Every swarming enemy is represented on that picture. Yep. So. It's All by right. far the fi my favorite art that we've ever had commissioned. I, yeah, I'd agree. It came out so well. All right. So, I will investigate. Mm -hmm. Three up. No, two up. What are we at here? Two up, yeah. Right at three. So, okay, yep, so two up. Two up's fine, I think. Given the spare actions I have, yeah. Cool. Minus two. Oh, wait, I lone wolf yeah. first. And then I get a yep. resource from Thieves' Kit. Yep. Uh, and then I get a clue. Two actions left, hey? Yeah, I think I will fast out Trusty Bullwhip just to, like, not overload my hand here. And, mm -hmm. like, I have plenty of resources to spare. We'll fast that out. I was actually going to suggest putting out Grim Memoir. And then if you do have to replace either your Thieves Kit or your Grim Memoir, like you have another copy okay. of each in hand. I respect that. I don't think that's bad. And hell get out a, a liquid courage. Yeah. So I don't think you need to draw cards. Nope. And I don't think you need resources. Nope, so. that's, that's just going to happen, so. Yeah. Yum, yum, yeah, Schultz. Tasty finger yeah. meat. Tasty finger meat. The... Dota chum? Dota <laughs> choy? Did a check. All right. Lovely. Um, So, I didn't move, so we don't jack. So, we just regular upkeep. Mm -hmm. <gasps> oh, Oh, there she is. Mi amor. All right. Lovely. End of the round. We spend two clues and advance. Hmm. So now here's the question, and viewers, you can chum in, chime in. Sorry, on uh, did a chum? which island to go to? Did a chum? You can did a chum in. Discard all players for cats of Ulthar. Oh god, that's right. This resets Pack the this. encounter deck real hard. Okay. Yeah. That. That one. No, that's fine. Pack of Vuvuzela leaves. These two swarm cards go on the bottom of your deck. Dugs. 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 Yodi says Forbidden Lands sounds cool. There's kind of a, an interesting strategy choice here. I'm just going to vamp while you sort your cards there, Sean. Please. Um, I like Forbidden Lands. Um, it does sound like a place Jack would go for sure. Uh, we were talking before the show and, and Sean was kind of leaning towards Timeless Realm and we were discussing, because like, timeless, timeless Realm takes a while. Um, but if you're going to do it, I think you need to do it first because you're not going to have time to do it last. My only concern is sometimes you get so tied up in the Timeless Realm that's the only one you do. Um, did you take care of the but... Vuneths and the Swarm cards? I did, yeah. Lovely, thank you. These two are over here. Yeah. Um... <clears throat> So I don't know, it, it's it's a toss up. I I think with the clue tech that we currently have, Janae in hand and stuff like that, I think Timeless Realm can go quick enough that we'd be able to do Timeless Realm and maybe two others. So Sean, if your heart is beating towards Timeless Realm. You know, I I, I didn't have a strong plan, but <clears throat> I do I do like knocking that one out and then just feeling like I'm on bonus time for the rest of the scenario. So, mm. 
Bonus timeless. <laughs> That's right. Yep. Okay, so I think we're good there. So then we oh we set these aside. No, and there's no victory points here, right? Negative. No. Be gone. Well, let's go to timeless. All right. Oh, error in script. Okay. Oh well, no, it says error in script, but then it did it right. <laughs> all right all right well i guess i'll i'll just double check i'll double check via the app yeah wandering toque well, hey you oh man wandering toque is at least a couple kilometers away from me <laughs> you say that about a lot of people scott <laughs> No more than a couple kilometers away from you? <laughs> uh, <laughs> under 100. Okay. You know, you like how you consider the cards you have in hand in the player? And just, yeah, I mean, that's... It, it, yeah. It, when you're playing solo, that's uh, definitely, definitely an important consideration. Yeah. Like, what can you tackle? Um, especially, I think, when considering the Timeless Realm, because it is so action and time intensive you want to make sure that you're like if we only had like one piece of clue tech and didn't have janae and the bullwhip and all that stuff i'd be very hesitant to go to timeless but i think that timeless we can here i'm saying this but now i'm very worried that my words are gonna bite me now see it says it erred but it definitely just did it right um yeah increase of a thousand masks because it has with clegg and we go to the King's Decree. What? There we go. Boop. All right. Find and cover many signs of the gods as you can. Go back to a port. Um, you can Did we get any the... signs yet? Oh, we forgot to flip the the veiled the port. Oh yeah, totally, totally. Yeah, that was that was that was an error. Yeah, let's just assume that anytime we can flip veiled, that is beneficial. We know this game well enough. I always forget about that uh, mechanic. Your quest is uncovered. Blah blah blah. So, flip back so, over. so I'm just, just going to heal the horror side. off of Virgil with uh, Virgil's yeah. ability. You know, there's details that I always notice when we when we do TTS that I I never see on the actual cards. Virgil's got a little bit of like that like thin mustache above. Oh yeah, above his upper lip, doesn't he? It was like that. What are they called? The pencil mustache. He's he's rocking the Clark Gable. Mm hmm. Okay. Okay. So I think. Yeah. That was the end of the round. At... Place each investigator at kill a face. Oh. Really? Mm-hmm. Yep. Do we not? Are they connected okay. properly? Yeah. Uh, I guess so, yeah. I always thought that... Okay, yeah. Yeah, I think part, part of the reason this takes so long is because you got to, like, double back on this tiny map. Right. Okay. Um. So that was end of the round. So now we go to five of seven doom. Mm -hmm. And draw. Hunted by Corsairs, attached to the current act when the act advances. Each investigator takes two damage. And then it's uh, my two best stats to, to get rid of it. So that's, that's yeah, okay. Yeah, that's... Uh, Everyone this helps is like me high. honest on this. I'm going to put it up here, but it's very far out of my view on TTS. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. There's only one bad so, veiled card. I think that's accurate. I think I think just Ulthar is the one that like actively punishes you for yourself flipping it. There are other ones that like, yeah. flip themselves. Yeah. I'm and pretty sure. Curiosity you're right. makes the cats kill you. All right. Lone Wolf. Boop. Yeah. First action, play one of the best cards in the game. Yep. Maybe. Action <laughs> one. We'll play down Genet. Someday I'd like to see her eyes and let her know how much she means to me. Oh, so kind. Um, okay, 
and then we will what's up Fi? yeah no it's really starting now truly both janae and Fi show up at the same time coincidence mm-hmm have you ever seen them are you a room? winning son <laughs> kind of all right so the second action i'll investigate here um might as well use Thieves' Kit. Yeah, let's keep going with Thieves' Kit since I yep. burst down here. Keep the um, foot so, on the gas. Yeah, so with Janae, that puts me at four up. Mm -hmm. Let's draw okay, another. Right. Beauty. Cool. And this, Here's your clue. Cultus only does anything if it fails, right? Yeah. Here's your resource. Cool. And we flip Veiled. Mm-hmm. Blah, blah, blah. Story, story. Remember that you have beseeched the king. Shuffle a copy of Tenebris Night Gaunt into the deck. Flip this back over. I'm on it. Yep. Second action. I will move to Serenian. As an additional cost for you to enter or leave, you must choose and discard a card from your hand. I think I'm safe to ditch a thieves kit from my hand. Oh. Over Grim Memoir. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. I got, I got Lone just... Wolf, and I always have the option to jack for resources. 